This brief video is part of a project to strengthen our appreciation of our tefillah, of for the Shmonesre. I would like to focus on the bracha that ends with the words Goel Yisrael, and this is Re'en Nova and Yenu Bitrin Ta'Kodesh Baruch that you should see our affliction, see our difficulty, and we ask for the redemption for the Geula. Now, if you look at it carefully, you realize that this must not be talking about the Geula that we are waiting for, for the redemption of the Mashiach, because that will make its appearance a little bit later. In other words, at this point of Shmon Esri, we're first asking for things we need now. Refua, Brochem Parnasa. Only later do we turn to our national needs, a return to our Sisrol with the Binyan Beis Amigdash, coming of the Mashiach. So what is this brocha really about? So Rabbi and Abishis explains, but you have to understand, you know, you go through life and there are challenges. There are challenges, there are daily surprises, situations that we would appreciate not to have. But a person that experiences redemption is a person who understands that everything that takes place is there for a reason. It's a tailored life. In other words, you could have a person running around, taking care of all kinds of things, and on the surface, it would appear to be a person that is having challenges, but really it's a scavenger hunt. He's having fun, actually, because things were designed in a specific way that you have to find things and address things, and it could be fun and meaningful. And this bracha is really a bracha that we should merit to understand that everything we go through, everything we experience, is there for a reason. And that's really a redemption. That's a geula. When I think that life is just random and things happen for no reason, and then I face a challenge, a situation that I don't really appreciate, it's overwhelming, it's painful, it's something I wish is not there. But if suddenly I go through that redemption, and just as the redemption, the geula of Yemosa Mashiach, will be clarity in an understanding of why things are taking place, we could have that during our life today. We could experience a person, a personal geula. And understand, you know what? There's a reason I have to go through this. I'm not gonna understand why I could live with question marks, but at least I know it was tailored for me. That's a geula. That's the geula that we are referring to here. And that's what we daven for as we turn to HaKadosh Baruch Hu for Slicha, and we turn to HaKadosh Baruch Hu for Rafua. We also turn to him for assistance to give us the ability to see that everything taking place is there for a reason. It's a bracha among the many that we have to focus on because we'll look at life differently, we'll look at situations differently, we'll have the tools to deal with challenge. Uh, and Be'ezra Hashem with strengthening tefillah, may Yaakadosh Baruch Hu turn, tune in. And may the Shomeat Fila hear the Tfilos that Klal Yisrael turned to him with. It's a time of challenge. Uh, a, a lot of news that is painful to hear. Uh, but we have always turned to our Shmon Esrei, And hopefully, and we're very, very grateful to those in the community who are putting time and effort to bring everyone together for Chizuk in this area. And may we merit by having a personal Geula to experience the national Geula Bimeheira Viamenu. Thank you.